of two brochures. This first brochure talks about the three sites that make up the Manhattan Project National Historic Park. Right. Which is Los Alamos, Oak Ridge, Tennessee, and Hanford, Washington. Uranium was here, yeah. plutonium was here, we shipped here. here. <laughs> Originally, when they first decided to do this project, their offices were on Manhattan Island in New York, and it was called the Manhattan Engineering District, and they thought that was a giveaway to what they were building, so they changed the name just to the Manhattan Project. Ashley Pond is just outside the building here on our left or your right. Okay. The, it's a self-guided walking tour that walks goes around the pond, goes across the street right over here to Fuller Lodge, which was part of the boys' school that was here before the government bought it okay. and turned it into the Manhattan Project. Okay. It's kind of where they had graduation and cafeteria and stuff. Behind it was almost historic museum and then bathtub row houses, which were the houses for the school teachers when it was a school. When the government bought it, it became the houses for the most prominent physicists and scientists. So Oppenheimer's house was here, Fermi and Beta. Eventually it winds over here at the Bradbury Science Museum. It's a free museum, a lot of replicas of the bombs that were made, but what's really neat is they have a lot of interactive science things because it's sponsored by the Lab for Kids, so it's a really fun museum to go to. Here's your Junior Ranger book. Now besides walking tour, we have a 20 minute video you're welcome to watch. Okay. Or I can do a ranger program for you. I don't know why the city's called Los Alamos. <laughs> it's a Spanish name, which means the Cottonwoods. And when the boys' school was up here, um, all that was up here was just cottonwood trees around the pond. The laboratory does only 20% of the work that's on weaponry. The rest of it's on renewable energy projects, uh, astrophysics, nuclear medicine, um, all sorts of cool stuff. So, Who wants to hold the map? Mm, I will. shop here it's all things made by people in, within the region oh and then back there we have a show going on it's exhibit called spirit Lodge. Well, the Fuller lodge was built in 1928 as the dining hall for the los alamos ranch school during project y the lodge hosted community activities for lab employees It's a Boy Scout school. Why are we going to Los Alamos Ranch House Ranch School, 1918 to 1943. This school and its summer camp, unique and American secondary education, centered on Fuller Lodge. Students came from every part of the country. This museum features exhibits on the Manhattan Project as well as the people of Los Alamos from ancient through contemporary times. Some old ruins. Those houses over there are on Bathtub Row. 1940s era view of what would later be named Bathtub Row. We want to see the WAC dormitory, World War II cafeteria, or should we go straight to the Bradbury Museum? Straight to the, the Bradbury Museum. We kind of saw the fun stuff. World War II cafeteria. This building was the favorite mess hall for the military members of the project. Now it is the Los Alamos Performing Arts Center. Something smells good. Bathtub robe brewing store. There's food here too. Right at 15th and next to it. Oh, it's a central and 15th. If you want to see what's happening on Mars today, you just walk by there and you can see the pictures from Mars coming in. Oh, cool! Because the, Mar the Curiosity Mars robot was built here at the laboratory and so they do that. So oh, if you guys want to see what looks like Mars, this and it's on the way to the museum the anyway. The Mars so. robot was made over here? Yeah, it's made here. That's so cool! Do you want a badge or a patch? Badge. I want to see both before I choose. Uh -huh. So do I. Let me get one of these. 
badge. Oh, look at that patch. I want a patch. I want a patch. I want both now. No, one or the other. Mm. I want a patch. Somebody want to wear the Oppenheimer hat? I do. That's the Weston, that's you want to wear the Oppenheimer hat? <laughs> Oppenheimer hat. <laughs> okay, let's come over here. I wore a hat like this. Raise your right hands. Big smile. So repeat after me. As a junior ranger. As a junior ranger. Of the Los Alamos Manhattan Project. Of the Los, Los Alamos Manhattan Project. National Historic Park. National Historic Park. I promise. I promise to learn more about to learn more about the science and history the science and history of the Manhattan Project of the Manhattan Project and World War II. In World War II, I will explore. I will explore many more many more national parks national parks and help to protect and help to protect. And preserve them. And preserve them for future generations. For future generations. Congratulations. You cannot get that. Can you get to the Trinity site at all? Can you see it? Nope. You can go there two days a year. First Saturday in April and the first Saturday in October. The rest it's an active bombing range. So the oh. government graciously quits bombing those two days and allows us to go in there to visit it. He wanted to. But if you drive yeah. by it, the site where you turn to go down the road, there is a plaque. What can stop it? You can see that, but you can't actually go into the site itself now. Let's say we have it. Got it going the right direction. Leave space for that one too, remember? Maybe right here. So now we gotta go to. Oak Ridge, Tennessee, and Hanford, Washington. Hanford, Washington. Washington.